Hey there fellow Factorians, I'm here with yet another episode of our Let's Learn Bobs and Angels series. Okay, so first of all, let's just recap. We are having iron problems, aren't we? Uh, ooh, we're also having radar problems, anyway. Uh, yes, our iron is uh, it's, it's not too bad, but um, it is a bit of an issue. Now, before we go any further, uh, I did have a comment that. A comment from, uh, I think it was uh, Matt's Western, yes, that the GUI here allows you to offset things and you can save some belts. Look at that. Uh, that is super, isn't it? Wow. Man. Alright, we are definitely going to be doing that. Oh, that is, that is, uh, that is ridiculously good, actually. Um, Coming from Vanilla Factorio, that ability alone is the most amazing thing I have ever seen. Um, it also means that basically everywhere here uh, we can just do away with this just by having, uh, say, every second one of setting back. Just like that. Oh, that is amazing. Look at that. Wow. Alright. I will be remembering that for days. Um, oh crap, let's put this in this crap. And go there and uh, go in there. Cool. Alright, so that is used up. How much we got in here? We've still got a uh, 3k in there. Alright. This is still getting used for stuff? Yes, it is. And yeah, the stone. Lots and lots of stone. Alright. Um, again, uh, we can. I'm not going to change it now, but uh, we could have been doing that stuff there. All right, so that stone is going in there. Do we have stone on the bus somewhere as well? Oh yeah, I am. It's, it's coming out there. Cool. All right, let's uh, let's focus back in on what we wanted to do from the end of last episode, which, if I remember correctly, was try and fix up our ore with uh, a totally different style of of plate um, and it was from uh, alright that is all processing and that is what we wanted wasn't it yeah alright we're just keeping uh, keeping that rolling okay uh, now where are we back in here back in here I should have left clicked there we go okay so we're gonna make this from molten ore now and uh, that is that is all we have. Uh, yes. Oh, okay. Uh, iron sheet. So this is what we're getting now, and we're gonna get it pretty quickly. So this is probably what we will focus on. Uh, what do we need to make an iron sheet? Is molten iron and water. And molten iron is from ingots, which is from ore. All right. Uh, so we still need we still need ore. It still goes from ore. Okay, so we're going to tap into into this here. So instead of going into here, we are going to be making uh, molten ore. Now let us have a look at where that fits. Here we go. Uh, it is done in an induction furnace. Okay, let us make ourselves an induction furnace. Oh, I, I'm there. Okay, cool. Uh, we need a little bit of iron. That is all. And we can make an induction furnace. And we're going to need some more steel. Alright, we need more steel. I think I had some steel being made, but let's uh, let's pick up some iron and uh, and make some more steel because we're going to start using a lot of it. And uh, unfortunately, man, this iron is just not up to the not up to task. All right. Uh, let's put sort of a half, and then another half. And then we'll still have a little bit of iron on us. Um, is there any in here already? Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, oh, that was, um, damn, that tech just flew past. Uh, okay, we don't have that just yet. But this is, okay, so this is our new smelting, which makes a recipe for two iron ore sheet, iron sheet coils. Okay, that's what we want. So let's focus on that. Um, sheet, no, coil. Uh, nope. Iron. 
iron sheet coil. There we go. Okay. So we can make two in a or four with some coolant. We don't have any coolant, so that's uh, that's not happening. Um, I guess that recipe just changed that because I'm sure that was just one from that, but now we've got two. All right, enough. Um, and that happens in a casting machine, so we need a uh, casting machine as well. All right, so let's uh, let's put these things together and see what happens. So induction furnace. Here we go. Um, all right, let's uh, let's keep that alignment. Pop it there. So this guy is going to be making, ooh, okay, um, 12 manganese silicon. Uh, we're just going to stick with the original. Uh, it is making, uh, oh, it's making from iron ingots. How do we make an iron ingot? Well, let's have a look, shall we? Iron ingots, here we go. Uh, 24 ore for processed iron. We do have, okay, that's good. We don't have that one, we don't have that one, okay. So let's see, processed iron and coke. Processed iron is made from iron ore. Um, hang on, let's have a look at that. So four iron ore makes two processed iron. Uh, so, uh, what is that for? 16 would make 24. Okay, that is pretty good. So we want, that is made in a ore processing machine, which I guess must be this one. Casting, induction, casting, strand casting. Um, or processing machine. There we go. Okay. All right. So this is uh, this is not the first thing we want to do. The first thing we want to do is turn iron ore into processed ore. So that's correct. Um, four iron ore into two processed ore in a ore processing machine. Okay. Cool. 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 Let's find that one. Ore processing machine. There we go. Uh, let's bring some power over here. What's the power? All right. Uh, so we want to. Uh, for now, we'll just. Um, no. For now, we will just take this and bring it over here, and then that needs to go into here. And you are making processed iron ore, uh, and that goes into what to make an ingot. Uh, that goes into a blast furnace. I don't think we've made one of those, and we need coke for that as well. Okay. Uh, blast furnace probably needs some steel, doesn't it? Uh, oh, we are short bricks. Happy days. Let's uh, grow up to our bricks. Oh, a fair bit of that. All right, let's grab those. Let's make a blast furnace. Uh, metallurgy, metallurgy smithing. Yeah, there we go. Blast furnace, chemical furnace. All right. Um, so now blast furnace. We also need some coke. How are we going to get coke down here? Because coke is way up here. Um, better to meet in the middle. Whew, I don't know. Uh, but while I'm up here, why don't we do? That one offset to there. Yeah. All right. Keep this going. Uh, that is going. That is going well. All right. So we need to jump this down uh, through all of this jazz, kind of in here if we can. All right. Now uh, let's bring it down here. Looks good. Yeah. Look at that. Beautiful. All right, and then here we need to. No, no okay. Uh, it's here that we need to do something. What we're going to do is that. Get some nice spaghetti here. Yeah, that. Uh, no, not that. Let's kill that. Oh, we don't even need that one. All right, that's good. Uh, this is actually going to disappear once we get this up and running. Okay, here is our coke. Coke, 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 coming. Uh, it is coming. Okay. Now that goes into what do we what do we say? Um, processed iron uh, goes into a blast furnace. Blast furnace. Blast furnace. Blast furnace. Oh, that is huge. All right. 
Um, let's see if I can't never know where the top is. I think that must be the top there. All right. So we're going to direct insert that into there. Uh, and we are making that. Yes, we are. All right. And you are going over to here. And we'll power that up. Uh, it also needs fuel, but it can get. The coke can be fuel as well, which is nice. Alright, so we'll do some ratio. So this is producing uh, two in two seconds, and this is using uh, two in four seconds. No, two every second. This is producing one a second, and this is using two a second. So I actually need two of these. Uh, I don't have another one. There we go. Okay, cool. Um, I'm not sure if we'll be able to support this from just the one, but let's uh, let's see how we go. Here we go. All right, uh, and that one's made. Copy that in there. Let's actually get these the right way around. We'll change. Right, we might actually need multiples of these if we want to uh, get this to do it fast enough. Okay, so this is producing one a second, so we should be able to do it with just a regular inserter-ish. Okay, uh, why is this not taking coke? Because that's not coke. That's charcoal. Ah, oh, that is a problem. Oh dear. Oh dear, alright, well, we'll have charcoal down here, that's handy. Ah, oh, carbon, sorry. Um, alright. Change of plans, change of plans. How much inventory? I might be able to pick up a lot of this carbon. Um, oh man, that is that is very disappointing. All right, now how do we get coke? Coke is the output from this. Yes. Okay. Uh, that is going to require us to change things slightly. All right. If I do that and that, uh, I can go there. That can go there. Alright, this is not the be most beautiful thing I've ever done, but it saves us rebuilding this. Okay. <laughs> it works. It works, and that's the main thing. And it's actually even evened out on both sides. Um, but this is only getting fed from one, which is not something I'm entirely happy with. So what I want to do is put this split here. Yep. There we go, okay. Because uh, we want this carbon to be uh, continue to be made. And honestly, we're probably going to um, probably going to want to expand this at some point as well. Alright, let's just do that. There we go, okay. And now it's as though we did not make that stupid mistake again. But yeah, we'll uh, we'll look at we'll, we'll look at um, expanding this whole arrangement once we get the need for the coke. Alright. Uh, and of course we have to pick up all of this delightful carbon. Uh, carbon, carbon, carbon. Come to me. All ye mighty carbons. Uh, this is just really annoying, isn't it? So what happens when you don't check a recipe? All right. No one to blame but ourselves. And rightfully so. I'm tortured by copious amounts of other crap things. Uh, let's get rid of this coal because we definitely don't need coal anymore. A lot of burnables in our inventory. So, that should now be coke. And there it is, it's coming down very, very slowly. Um, oh, that's... okay. So what I should also do is, because we're not making a whole heap of coke, let's, um, let's bring this in here to actually fuel this. Is that going to work? Can it be fueled by... Uh, well, it needs power if we're going to actually use that. Um, Yes, okay, so we'll fuel it by that, that's pretty good. And then we just need the coke to come in as well. 
Alright. And we're seeing a little bit of that, but I think I've got some on me. Let's pop it in there. There we go, okay. So now we are producing iron ingots. And that iron ingots needs to turn into molten iron. Molten iron. We can do 12 into 20. Uh, yeah, that's it. We don't have those things at all. Okay, this is what we're doing in our induction furnace. Induction furnace, beautiful. Um, let's power that up. And this needs to be, yep, that one. And it needs 12 ingots in four seconds, three a second. So we'll do, uh, we'll do four of those because we're generous. Uh, and that is the yeah, ample. All right, and that is creating molten iron. Now that molten iron, <laughs> this is a very complex thing, turns into iron sheets in a strand casting machine, which was in one of these other, uh, what was this one, wasn't it? Uh, blast, blast, chemical, just been this one. Strand casting machine, we are out, oh no. Clay bricks, we do not have any clay bricks. How do we make clay brick? Uh, clay brick comes from unburnt clay brick, of course, does. And that comes from clay, sand, and lime. Clay comes from mud water. Uh, okay, sand comes from mud water. And lime comes from limestone. And limestone comes from things we don't have. Uh, things we don't have. Uh, light mud water. Okay. So we're back on the mud water train. And uh, let us head on over to the mud water. Alrighty. So I think they were all in chemical chemical something or others, weren't they? Um, uh, so yeah. Uh, washing. Okay, that was a washing one. Um, uh, that is a washing machine. And that is... Uh, hang on, hang on. What did I just do there? Lime. Uh, ooh, what, have, what have we done? Okay, we've gone too far. So, lime comes from limestone or that stuff that we don't have uh, and the limestone comes from the mud water okay so the limestone comes from mud water and we can burn off the carbon dioxide all right and that's in a blast furnace so we need a washer for the limestone I think it was um, a washing two Ooh, okay let's get that um, how else can we make it? We can have that tech. Okay, we need the washing too. Um, we'll, we'll get there. Alright, let's get these washing machines. I think I've got some uh, in this chest, if I remember correctly. Uh, yeah, we've got two washing plants. Oh man, this is getting complex again. Thought it was going to be a nice, easy, easy road, but of course not. Um, Alright, so, washing machine, washing two, there we go, alright. Uh, we can make a washing two plant, we need clay brick for it, of course, uh, but we now get limestone, yeah! Alright, let's have a look at our recipes. Okay, so, cocaine, um, okay, so clay is concentrated mud water. Uh, which one is that? Saline, uh, thin, white, Concentrated. All right. So here we need to pop in one of these. All right, and this is going to make clay. Clay, clay, clay. No, it's not going to make clay. Apparently, um, clay. Okay, there we go. That's why, because it also needs regular water, which we can certainly provide it with. Uh, let's just do that. All right and power it up over here so we can get the clay out. Concentrate mud water, 
that in. All right. Uh, that is our clay. Next up. Um, next up, we need sand, which is the thin mud water, which light thin. All right. Uh, there we go. And you are making sand. Uh, no, go that way. Uh, that and that. Build squeak through. Saves the day again. Um, and then we'll do that. So that is sand. And then finally, we need limestone. Um, and we need another washing plant. And where were they? Petrochem? Water treatment. There we go. Uh, C4 pump, washing plant, I need some steel. Alright, we do have some prepared earlier. Alright, one more washing plant. And the limestone recipe uh, was light mud water. Alright, uh, is that this one? Thin light, there we go, okay. Uh, didn't have it made yet. There we go. All right. So you are limestone. Look at that. Easy, easy peasy. Light mud water and regular water. Um, well, that's that's just really sad, isn't it? There we go. Look at that. All right. So now we have these three things, and we need to get them out here. Do that. All right. Uh, is it even numbers? Is that what we need for a, a clay? It is. Sorry, how do we make it? Uh, it's four clay, and then two of those and two of those. Okay, so we're gonna do. We're gonna do that. That is what we are going to do. Yes, it is. Um, oh, we'll just put it there. That's all right. So this one's going to output there, and then. So we're going to output there, but we're going to offset it. Man, that's such a beautiful thing. Um, like that. There we go. And uh, we'll get rid of that. Get those picked up. So we need that. And then this needs to output. Oops. And output like that. There we go. All right. And there we have what we need to make a clay, uh, clay unburnt clay brick which is made in an assembly machine. Yay! Oh, Alright, let's, uh, let's do a couple of them, shall we? And... Uh, clay... Unburnt clay brick is a metallurgy casting. And then we're going to need a blast furnace or something to no doubt um, fix those up. Alright, we're actually going to need uh, two of these. We can get some power over here. That's not very good. Right. There, there. And this outputs uh, four in four seconds. So one a second. All right. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's put one on the inside. <laughs> Man, that's just so good. All right. You need to pick up there, and you need to. Whoops. No, 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 no. Uh, you need to pick up from there. All right. Looks like we lost you. There you go. And you are not working because we forgot that we need to turn limestone into lime. Alright, well, uh, let's do that before we do this. Alright. Um, hmm, limestone, go back in there. So, uh, let's turn that into lime. What do we need for that? Uh, we need to do that in a blast furnace. And that makes lime and carbon. Uh, blast furnace. Blast furnace needs some bricks. All right. I'm kind of regretting using this higher level one now. I think we uh, we might have reached a little too far. But let's let's just see what happens. I'm also going to need a uh, what are they? What are they? Burn off flare flare stack. That was it. Oops. We need one of those to get rid of. Uh, the carbon dioxide, which maybe we'll want to use at some point, but for now we'll burn the crap out of it. All right, uh, blast furnace. Here we go. Uh, where can I? Oh, I'm happy to fit that in. 
What about there, wouldn't it? There we go. All right. Uh, blast furnace. If I could pop that uh, there. There, there, right there, all right. And you are dropping off in there. Uh, no, that's not going to do it. All right, you're dropping off there. This moves down one. Blast furnace uh, down there. And you're grabbing from there because you are making lime. And then you're outputting, outputting to there. All right, let's see. See how this works. Um, oh, it needs fuel. We have a source of fuel available. We do. Um, we'll just uh, take a bit of this. We'll run it over here. Look at that. Perfect. And uh, pop you in there. All right. Let's uh, just pop a little bit of carbon in there for now. Let's get this moving. Um, but we need to. Okay, you also need to offset there. And then we need to drain this. Oh, that. Oh, that is, that is it. Alright. We are good. We need to get rid of that. And we can get rid of that. And we can get rid of. What else have I got here? So much crap. Um, Oh, I picked up lime. There we go. Alright, and then this is picking up the lime, and we have clay bricks. Unburnt clay bricks, okay. Um, we also then need to burn the clay brick in uh, smelter, 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 smelter. Alright, one is to one. Uh, so we have this lined up here. Let's put our smelters here. And uh, what are we going to do? Um, that down. All right. Yep. It's getting things are getting fun. All right. Bring this down like so, and then we'll have some furnaces going along there. All right. There we go. Yeah, that looks uh, looks semi decent. I don't know if we can support this, I haven't even looked at the ratios of this, but uh, where were we? Metallurgy. Uh, here we go. So this takes uh, four seconds, so that's one a second. And these have a crafting speed of one, uh, so that's one a second, that's six a second. And how many are we making? Uh, we are making one a second, we're making two a second, so that is, yeah, that is way off, isn't it? Um, now, why aren't you taking? Why aren't you taking that? Because you have no power. Well, that was obvious, isn't it? Um, there we go. All right, and voila. There we go. And then we are outputting this down here. We'll want to have some uh, some of that into a box, but also we want to feed. Feed more of it uh, elsewhere. All right, let's do that. And uh, I think we're gonna. I think there's a lot of things that need clay bricks. So, uh, what was that clay brick for? Uh, that was for creating something of one of these strand casting machine. We need so much steel as well, man. Should have been making steel while I was doing that. Um, let's pop that in. Let's. Steel is probably the next thing once we've actually sorted out iron. Uh, we are going to have to try and get steel happening. Uh, and hopefully we can do something similar to this one where we get a better recipe for the steel. Alright, and while all this is happening we actually halved our iron input because we did that. So, uh, good on us. Let's get that going because this took a little bit longer than I was hoping. Um, all right, that is 280 divided by 8 is like 30. Another 30. Ah, oh, steel. Yeah, that steel recipe is a killer, isn't it? I actually need a lot of steel for this. Because uh, we need uh, steel. 
Uh, is it this one? No. This one. We need steel pipe. Yeah, we need 48 steel. Okay, we have we have eight steel. That's sucky. Um, all right, but we also need clay bricks. And what's going on with our clay? Uh, this has stopped for some reason. Oh, we've got the flare stack. We've got the flare stack. Don't worry. We got it. We got it. Uh, flare stack goes here. And let's get some pipe and burn that off. All right. There we go. Good stuff. We're back in action. All right, so that will get us that. This will get us 44. Is that how much we needed? Uh, 48. Oh, gosh. That's the end of it. Need more iron. Uh, wow, our iron has gone even worse. I know, that. that's just how slow the belts move now. Yep. That's right. That is just how slow the belts move. All right. Let's grab this. A whole lot. Anything that's in there, give it to me. All right, how are we doing for time? We are right on the 30 minute mark. I would really love to get this going though. Um, we get a strand, strand casting machine. There we go. All right, give me that. Give me that. We are good for bricks. No, we're not bricks. We will be good for bricks now. One more brick. There we go. All right. Um, this is actually doing nothing at this point, so let's just do that, and we'll we'll sort that out with a uh, with a something later. And there we go, steel plates and a strand casting machine. Ah, well, alrighty. We now have a strand casting machine, which allows us to create iron coils from molten. Whew. Ah, man. All right. I assume it's going to be roughly that size. What's the ratio of this? This is producing 24 in 4 seconds, so it's producing 6 a second. This is using uh, 3 a second, so we can actually support 2 of these. Wow. Um, and this is making uh, 30 a second. And our strand casting machine is using using what uh, is using 20 a second okay so the ratios aren't aren't exactly right but that's okay uh, I don't suppose we need pipe let's get that in there and we need some water and because I'm lazy I'm going to make one of those pumpies that of course we need iron for there we go all right and then that produces a steel core we're not done yet though we are not done yet, not by a long shot. Um, Alright, let's get that going in there, but because that's right, it's a weird shape. Uh, just regular water, please. Uh, we haven't powered that up, that's why it's not working. That's good, okay. Well, sorry, it's not good, but that is what it is. And uh, let's put that there, and then. Alright, we are operational. So it's making two. Two in four seconds, so one every two seconds. Now, we just need to get that sheet into something. Uh, iron, iron sheet coil? No, okay. So I just gotta do that. Alright, so iron sheet coil then gets turned into four iron plate in, of all places, an assembly machine. And it uses. Uh, that actually, the last step. Is not so bad at all. All right, so let's uh, give it a bit of space. Give it a bit of space and iron plate from an iron sheet coil. It uses uh, two a second. Okay, so well we can su just support one, not quite even one. That's all right. That's okay, isn't it? We're happy with that. There we go. Let's get you powered up. Let's get you recipeed up and. We are away. Alright, and then uh, you can go up here and like that. I should have that one there. Uh, it looks like we actually can do a double output here. Let's put this one back 
beautiful offset, man. I love me some offset. All right. Oh god, that is already almost as good as that. Um, almost, I say. What have I? What have I read wrong here? Um, oh, I think we just had a backlog of of sheets. That's why. This is producing uh, two sheets every four seconds. So one every two seconds, half half a second, and this is actually using one every half a second. So uh, this can, yeah. Uh, this can support four of these. Okay. So we'll quickly run out of that. Uh, but our ratio here, our ratio is rough. Maybe next episode we'll look at uh, improving the ratios and getting that a little bit better because we really want to be making our iron plate as efficiently as possible. Um, for now, what I want to do is get this going. Not like that. Uh, I guess like this. Let's not gonna make it. There we go. All right. And like that. And we actually want to output priority right and output priority right. So we want it all coming in here um, as the most efficient way of using the ore. And then we'll uh, we'll figure out what to do with it after that. Next episode, we are going to yeah, make this even better. And then, we, yeah, here we go. We are, as you can see, we're starting to uh, starting to move the line down a little bit. That's all right. We are actually uh, producing too much. All right. Uh, let me if I add another one of those. That seems ridiculous, but let's do it anyway. Um, and I'll just do that. Arg. Um, all right, well, we'll commandeer some of that. There we go. And that should actually use up what we're making. Uh, oh, it's... F Ooh, hang on. It's four iron plate every half a second. That is crazy. Um, okay. Uh, I misread that totally. Uh, four in half a second. You're going to need something like this, I'm going to guess. Um... Yeah, all right. Man, I need that belt. I need some belt. Let's steal more of this belt. All right, that the furnace is dead to me. Um, let's do that and that. How does that sound? Seems pretty good if we actually powered this up. Yes, so four every half a second. Uh, yeah, that shouldn't, should, we should actually need eight of these, shouldn't we? Um, and that is, this is getting crazy. We are managed to output enough of it though. Yep, because we don't have any input. Okay, that's good now. Um, but look at that, beautiful. Things are looking much better. Like I said, yes, we'll play around with that next episode, we'll get the ratios right, and then we can maybe start looking at expanding our mining and crushing and sorting and even tapping into some of this sterilite. I don't know. We'll uh, we'll keep going. Iron is our big problem for now. We also need to make steel, so lots more iron required. Let's just keep it running and see where we get to. As always, love to hear your thoughts down below, and see you tomorrow.